Back to the game. Don't worry, he didn't miss much. So I came in here. Over, over here. And we just arrived at the peep bar. French. And I need to get used to remembering to... How did I... How did I put away my weapon? This might be important. And that's my stealth. C is changing your weapon. Changing your item. Okay, T is to holster your weapon. Alright, nice. Cool. Imagine up here is the peak bar. And I... This is our first time here. There's a thing here we can explore. Just gonna check that out real quick. It looks like we should be able to... Oh, focus energy already full. Nice. And just some random pickups here. Not, much, not a whole lot going on. Once we get inside the peak bar, we'll see what's actually going on with this place. There's some dudes here in the turrets. Hello, and welcome to the peak bar. Best drinks, best me. What else do you need? Be friendly, not annoying, and watch where you step. And this is important. Don't carry any weapons openly in there. We want it peaceful. Carry my weapon whenever I want. No, I'm not going to say that. I'm going to say, all right, we'll do. I'm going to be like a sane sort of person. Good. Don't draw your weapon in there. Guys, you're tense. All right. Tense in the puke bar. Let's see. This is, people are tense, but the entrance to the puke bar is a giant wolf mouth. So I, I think they're kind of setting the tone for tents. You think? All right, we are entering. So I have to be careful. I think the shift key and the mouse wheel will both cause my weapons to come out. So I'm not going to do that. Instead, I'm just going to talk. Welcome to the puke bar. I'm Eldred. What do you need? Booze? Meat? Something else? Let me see what you're offering. Sure. Virtual combat exercise. That sounds useful. The Cyber Womb Module. So, okay. I don't have quite enough gold for it. I'm close. There's booze and meat, and then that's literally it. Hmm, interesting. Okay, so I can't use this because my strength isn't up a high enough. Which is fine. I'll sell it. I'm mostly focused on blade weapons. Now I have a shotgun, an old rifle, and an energy gun, a revolver, and a cleaver. Those are my weapons. I don't really need all of them. The energy whip gun is very nice. What? What is it, Nova? What? Is that right? There you go. What's bothering you, huh? My little furball is meowing at me. Let's see, what else we got here? Canned food? Is it even worth it to keep this? It's only two gold. It gives you eight health, which is really not that great. That makes the vegan playthroughs really difficult. In case you didn't know, there's a vegan playthrough option, which is kind of like a hard mode where you can only eat canned food and other vegan like alternatives. I'm gonna sell my canned food though. Nano health, acid mug, booze, plastic trash. You don't need that for anything. I'm pretty sure you can't actually use that for crafting. Unless we just haven't got to the point where you can. We have a lot of crafting materials too. We gotta use that at some point. So, let's get combat expertise. Test your combat prowess in a small area. Hello. How are you doing? Hi. You're blocking the camera. Hey. What's going on? What's going on? Alright. Sorry, my dear. 
going on? <laughs> what? What's going on? Okay, I'm in the middle of something, dear. This is not the time, okay? Wait, did I buy it or not? I guess I didn't buy it. Welcome back. Let me see what we're offering. Let's get that virtual combat exercise. That sounds like it should be useful. Resources, body, mind, quest items. Virtual combat. Okay, it's a quest item. I wasn't expecting that, actually. We have the power module for... How did we get this? We got it for somebody. Or we just found it, one or the other. I can't quite remember. Well... We got something. So we have a quest involving a cyber womb at some point, obviously. Stranger. I'm watching you. Well, don't do anything stupid. Quick save. Hey, put that weapon away or you'll get killed. Oh, yeah. Just takes a little bit of moving around. Oh. I tried to holster my weapon, but I don't think I did it quick enough. Probably didn't matter anyway. Is that a game? Okay, no. Let's just reload the save. You can get as drunk as you want. Just keep your weapon down. Fair enough. They mean business. Oh, you're fresh, right? I guess I'm kind of fresh. Want some advice? Don't hang out with the wrong people. Who's that? Them fleshies and them flesh people. Can't trust them. Why can't I trust the fleshies? They're gonna kill you, hack you up, and build a new titan with your arms and liver and blood. They're building new titans from body parts? Yeah. You saw that some yourself, or heard that somewhere? Didn't see it with my own eyes, but it makes sense, right? I don't know if it does. <laughs> You haven't really explained what this is based on. I guess it could. See? Be careful out there. Don't let the fleshies catch you. Leave. Let's see what else is going on. Eldred had some other options there we didn't go through. So this is the puke bar. Anything interesting? Always. There are always there are travelers stopping by here. Drinks and food are good, obviously. We have a cyber womb room that may or may not be functional. Oh, well, there we go. And the bar is old enough that it has some secrets I can't tell you about. Obviously. Correct. Okay, it's pretty straightforward. Any work around here? Something worrying you? Actually, yes, we've got a little pest problem. Again. Oh, alright. But since you're asking, want to help us out with that? Sure. Great! You see, flesh maggots have made their nest inside the bar's meat reserves. And to get rid of them, we need something potent. Uh, is that the meat you're serving here? Yes. Like I said, we need something potent against flesh maggots. But we ran out of poison. <laughs> There's a doctor up in Taurus. He sold us that last batch. Try it over there. Right, will do. Alright, well... I guess we have to go buy some poison from the doctor that we talked to in Taurus earlier last time. What else we got over here? You got some booze to share? Sure. Man, you're the best. Okay. I wonder if that actually affects anything or it's just a place to give away booze for free. Boo hoo hoo. Gulp. Wah 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 wah. Gulp. Yuck. Oh, Mila. Why have you left? Okay, so we got a quest to talk to help him with his ex-girlfriend, I'm imagining. Just leave me alone. Don't want to talk. Wah, 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 wah. Mila, gulp. Just leave me alone. Don't want to talk. Okay. Doesn't have anything else to say. What's with that guy crying at the bar? That's just Nard being overly emotional. Used to have a pet flesh worm. Okay. <laughs> I mean... Flushworm could be his girlfriend. Called it Eula or something along that line. The last week it went too close to a turret. Got blown to smithereens immediately. Okay. 
gory sight, truly. But since then, he's been here, crying. I don't mind, as long as he pays. Okay. The meat here. It's been tasting so boring recently. <laughs> okay. I'm watching you. Don't do anything stupid. I'm definitely not drunk. Look, I can still walk in a straight line. Okay, maybe I can't. Here's a tip. Always stop before your last drink. The last drink always brings you over the edge. Stop just before that and you're good. Wouldn't that make the drink before your last drink the new last drink? You, me, that room over there. What do you say? I probably shouldn't. The bots told me something about being terminated. You believe them? Just come with me. It's gonna be good. Fuck okay, it. Let's do this. <laughs> okay, then. I, I wasn't expecting that to be so instantaneous, but there's that. Let's buy that Cyber Womb module again. Gotta sell. Sell the regular bullets. Sell the revolver. Which we, I don't think we sold last time. Wait. Actually, yeah, we did sell these. Did I? Oh, I must have bought this. I must have got the Cyber Womb module at this point. Quest items? Yeah, it's there. So it's the power module and there's the combat exercise. That's what I bought from Eldred. So, trying to enter these doors is, I'm assuming, that's what kills you. Oh. Oh, okay. I was kind of expecting it to just kill you here. Oh, my lockpick skill isn't high enough. That machine looks interesting. I don't know what's purpose, though. I literally just come out of that door. So I didn't even make it to the door last time. I just, I just say, are you twins? No, wait, there's three of you. This is the life. Tell me, are you happy? Not really. <laughs> then maybe you need a good puke. Washes out all the bad stuff. That's ridiculous. <laughs> Is that how basic? Oh. Oh, they they puke more when you step in other puke. <laughs> That's great. So then they see you puke, or they see you step in puke. That causes them to puke. <laughs> That's great. I'm watching you. Don't try anything stupid. Ooh, hoo, hoo. gulp. Okay, so he's crying about his flesh worm. What's with that guy crying at the bar? Being overly emotional. Gory sight. Alright, cool. I'm satisfied with all that. We should check out to see what's upstairs. Oh, you're fresh, right? I guess I'm kind of fresh. I guess I didn't call, talk to this person yet. Guess it could. Nah, that didn't update anything. What's over here? I never went to check that out. That'll come in handy. Is F5 quick save? Yes, it is. Okay, good to know. What do we see in here? Is this a restricted area as well? It's not extremely clear what's restricted and what's not. But I imagine that's just part of... Ooh, hardened vest. Okay, this is mer our merchant. Anti-polar clothes. Metal armor. Recipe shells. Recipe energy... S oh, okay, yeah. I need this. I need to come back to that at some point. Can I buy it right now? Like, can I sell enough stuff to buy it? That is two gold. Six gold. Twenty gold. Yeah, let's sell all our booze. 
and I feel like the acid mug might be more valuable than the, the gold I get from it. What else is there I, I can sell? Sell three of these, sell three of those, sell five of those, sell one of those, sell one of those. Alright. Is that that oh I probably sold more than I needed. I needed to sell. But that's okay. Got the recipe set for energy cells. That's the main thing. Alright, so do I need to read this? Crafting recipe learned. Stats. Ammo. Energy cells. Oh. Need ten trash, ten metal, zircon. Okay, cool. I like that. I don't have enough metal though. I gotten one one group of ten at least. Yeah. Alright, excellent. Because I actually really like the energy cells. The energy gun. When I get back into a combat situation then that might be what I use. Oh, I just realized I have two cleavers. I could have sold that one cleaver there. This feels like a trap. is off. New quest. Bits and dreams. Okay. That's what I needed. Quest. Where's our quests? We've gotten a few quests now. Activate a cyber room machine. Location old trees. Find one of the cyber room machines and power it up. So is this the cyber room machine? I guess it is. This machine is missing some kind of power module. Well, there we go. Alright, done. This machine is running. Alright, now we can put on that exercise module that we bought. Virtual combat exercise. Ooh, that's cool. That's a cool effect. Finished. Bits and dreams. Wait, does this... Okay, no. We're we're in a virtual reality area. We have no weapons. Sword, shotgun, spiked club, pistol. We'll pick up the sword and the shotgun. I'm not going to bother picking up the other two things. Focus energy already full. Oh, I have no abilities, so it's just just the sword and the shotgun. Maybe I'll pick up the pistol too, even though my pistol skill's low. Ow! Spike bush. So, I'm guessing... I was thinking that this was some type, type of... Ouch! Spike bush. I was thinking this was some type of challenge room, but it looks more like you just... Okay, I guess it is kind of a challenge room. Three, two, one. Got you. like do a simulation kill on you. It just does an actual kill, but since it reloads the game right here, then it really doesn't matter, does it? The game might even have like a like um a checkpoint system set up so that it makes sure it auto saves it for you 
in a specific way. Just to make sure it doesn't accidentally screw you over. Okay. This energy already full. Let's try it again. I'll give it one more shot. I don't know if I'll really get anything out of it, but... Alright, come on, buddies. Heck yeah. I appreciate the fact that his explosion kills his friends, too. Okay, let's kill this person with the... Do animalism... Dudes, they're they're tough. I have a hard time dealing with those guys. It's probably a strategy for them, but Okay, prepare to fight. Got to equip my gear. start here on this one. Is it random enemies each time? Because I didn't get an exploded guy in that first round there. Ooh. But yeah, it must be random enemies each time. Ah, man, the spiky bushes. They blend in so well with the environment. myself on a spiky bush. Well, that happens, I'm sure. We'll try the- we'll give this one more shot. If it's still just- if I still don't have- if I don't succeed, then I'll probably take a break from this and maybe try the simulator later. Simulator later. And also- oh, cool. you. Oh, hello. Woo! Gotta run. dude here. That flesh worm. They are useful, but if you end up killing one by accident, then it's kind of a problem in the middle of combat. Ooh. They have a long delay before they swing, which is nice. does anything for you mid-combat. Probably not anything good. Alright. Come on! Kill him quick! Ah! I wanted to kill the explodey dude. I was hoping if I did that quick enough, then he'd take out the rest, and I'd be able to survive. Well... Finished bits and dreams. Okay, so I'm just finished my quest now. Alright, well, let's head back then. 
I'm, I'm assuming this portal will take me back. I'm not just stuck there. That would kind of suck. It's not a very good simulation if you get stuck in it. Welcome to Cyber Womb. Which module do you want to start? Where can I get more modules? This information is not available. Cyber Womb modules are custom created experiences for the rare collector. Therefore, no traditional distribution channels exist. Yeah. That's fine. I can deal with that. We got one module for now, at least. So. I was thinking that there was some type of symbol up there, but it doesn't really look like much of a symbol. It's just a weird sort of pattern. Can we go down here? Nope. Nothing there. Is this a door? No. Hey, don't push me. Alright, I won't push you. What's in here? Is this off limits? It might be. Uh, no. That turret seems friendly. It's not killing me instantly, at least, anyway. The flesh provides. The sun is always there. Hey, don't talk to me. Okay. Mumbles inaudible. Oh. Did he just prevent me from looking in that locker? Two people will fit on this if they cuddle. Looks like somebody forgot to flush. Oh, man. I mean... You click on a toilet in an adventure game expecting dialogue. I don't know what other dialogue you could be expecting. Who's, oh, it's Custer. This is the guy I needed to talk to. Alright, so I'm gonna talk to him. First, I'll be back in like 30 seconds. I'm just gonna grab myself another drink. see what Custer has to say. It's gonna give us a new job or something else. Hi there, Gyrgos. Nice meeting you again. Still waiting on my contracts, or contacts for the selling the machine core. But I figure it's gonna happen any day now. Oh, that's it. Okay. So this quest line is kind of at a standstill, I guess. I was kind of hoping that talking with him would push it forward, but maybe not. Maybe I'm just kind of supposed to look for my own quests. So, I rebooted the Cyber Room, and I have that other quest. A friend of mine recently decided to travel around more. He's gone to, the pla to a place called Mine 19 to the west of here. I wonder how he's doing. Mine 19. What can find out? We didn't get a quest pop up for it, but I imagine we'll get something out of it if we find out what happens to them. I'm assuming it's not good. Okay. We could explore the downstairs a little bit more. Keeping in mind, this might kill us. Oh, there's a naked dude, of course. <laughs> oh, it's the same naked dude as before. Hey, welcome to my humble abode. I thought this place looked nice. Maybe I'll become begin decorating it. <laughs> Alright. Hey, I am not interested. Please leave me alone now. Do you, need do you need help with anything? Nah, I don't need any help. Okay, fair enough. I can't interact with those lockers. There is a lot of blood on the floor in the walls here. Nope. Oh. There's 
flesh worms down here. Wait, yeah, so the other... So there's the... There's the quest that I need to get poison for the flesh... Uh, the, for the meat down here as well. Can I just attack these dudes? There we go. I mean, that solves that problem, doesn't it? Or did they just keep on... Yeah, they just keep on regenerating. Hang on a second. Mind. Experience, 389. Okay, experience is still 389. <laughs> it was worth a check. But, I mean... I could carve myself out some meat here. I'm assuming that's what... No, maybe not. Looks like the bar is hoarding some meat here. I guess people over here get hungry too. Hmm. Oh, lockpicking. I have one out of two for lockpicking. is also one out of two. So the lock picking is kind of yeah, not having a good enough lock picking skill is keeping me out of some places. Do I have oh, you know what? I can upgrade my lock picking skill right now. There we go. Hmm. I'll just apply the one skill point and save the other for another time. Whenever I need to use more. Most forms of implants and tech abilities. Oh, we'll, we'll upgrade our cyber tech. Apparently empathy is a big one too. So, missing lockpick. Gadgets, lockpick. Probably gonna need another lockpick in a moment. Lockpicking success. Trash mechanics, meth ingredients, nice. All useful things. We need another lockpick now. Let's try this. Alright. What else we got here? Oh, another lockpick! Okay, we're going through the lockpicks today. I can make four more lockpicks if I need to. Metal, zircon, plastic crash. Nice. There's a painting? It's art, I guess. Is it anything other than art? No, it's just art. Okay, good to know. Hey, it's an adventure RPG. It's good to make sure. Come on. More lockpicks. Lockpicking success. Mechanics, booze, gems. Nice. Oh, we're able to okay, we still got room in our inventory. Okay, that's it for this area. Nice. So we've looted the off-limits area, and they can see us leaving. And now we're going. Booze. 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 Ha ha ha. Ha. Was it walking through the puke that caused? No. Okay. We're doing it some more. Okay, cool. There we go. I'm satisfied. I feel like we've done everything. Our work here is done. I imagine there's still more stuff to do with Custer, but... Also... Eh. Do we have any more quests? Oh, Mila. Find out more about Mina. Help Nard get over it. Should we just talk to Nard? Because I didn't actually talk to Nard after talking to the guy beside him. If we talk to Nard again, I wonder if we'll get some other options. Oh, Mila. 
Ooh, empathy, two out of four. I heard your story from the guards. Show what? I think I can help you. How? Mila is gone, and nothing will bring her back. I'm so alone now. All alone. Okay. Well, I mean, that gave us a quest update. Help Nard get over it. Find somebody to keep Nard company. <laughs> well. Not sure how I feel about this quest, but. It's not quite clear what the consciousness level of the flesh worms is. Because we can possess a flesh worm. So there's mine 19. That's where Buddy went. There's more stuff over here. There's still lots of other regions of the world I haven't even been to yet. Well, let's go to Taurus. Get the poison back for the flesh bar. Or, for the flesh for the peep bar. And that'll complete that. That isn't even really a quest, because it's not showing up in my quest marker. But I imagine I'll get something for it. Yeah, if not, then it's not a huge loss. Let's go to the... I think the daughter, doctor is near the center. The daughter, yeah. yeah. This... No, that is... Marla. We don't want to talk to Marla right now. Is this the doctor? Yeah, this is the doctor. Hello, do you need anything? Browse services, healing, nano health. Wait, there is no poison here. Did I not pick up that quest? Did I, did I end up losing that quest after having to do a reload? That might be the case. Oh well. All good. Android, please maintain peaceful behavior. Hey, don't talk to me. I wish I were still in the cyber room. Everything's bland out here. Hey, watch your shit. If I keep on pushing into somebody, will they attack me? Hey, don't push me. Oh, wait. My friend over there, isn't he the cutest? If you say so. He's just a bit insecure. Like a... Oh, that's good dude. Hey you, do you think I can win? Win what? Our competition. I need to win it. I just don't know if I can. Maybe you can help me? Oh. Hey, you're not trying to cheat here, are you? As if. What's this person doing here then? Um, giving spiritual advice? I see. Take all the advice you can. You s you'll still lose. What, what are they playing? Okay, so I need your help to win this. You win? Sounds like fun. What do you need? I'm not even going to ask what the competition is. There's a lot of that pink glibber stuff in the red forest to the south of here. It's gross. Never good stomach even looking at it. It's got to do something to my innards, right? Alright, I'll get it for you. I have some of that already, don't I? Ah, you brought me the stuff. Gross. And down with it. Okay, I'm ready. Come here. You sure? You're not gonna cry when you lose, right? I won't lose. Oh, they're having a cute contest, I see. Not bad, not bad. But look at this. About the same as mine, but that was just a warm-up. Here's the real deal. That's a lot. And why is there some pink stuff in it? Anyway. That's nowhere near enough. Look at this. This is just going on. I can't anymore. I give up. Really? Yes. Does this mean I won? Congratulations. Finally, I'm so happy I could just puke again. Yeah, that's what I thought. 
thanks to you, I could win that bet. I'll never do that again. Did I even get anything out of that? I feel like I've been scammed. That's to some degree. I might have gained some experience. That's okay. I didn't pay attention to how much experience I had before. And if there was a notification, I missed it. Uh, we've already pretty much explored this whole place here. So, let's head back out. We've already been to the Red Forest. We've been to Monker 7. Oh, I did not mean to click that. Okay. What else have we got here? Woundland. What if we just go this way? I wonder if we'll run into anything there. I'm gonna save it just, just in case. Just a quick save. A safety save. Oh, here we go. We got company. Whatever this is. This is my first time doing this. Oh, they're just standing there. It's just one person, too. I mean, there might be more than one person here. No, the screen is not going any further. Bloody hell. Ooh. There, got you. Took more help, more hits than I should have, but actually it didn't hurt me that much. Surprisingly. That will come in handy. Was that it? There must be more. stuff up here? No. No, that's it. Okay. That wasn't nearly as threatening as I thought it was going to be. Alright. I'll we'll continue wandering around aimlessly over here. I wonder if we could pass through this place here. When we're ready to go check out mine 19. Oh, here's another encounter. Anomaly. This is, it said encounter before, now it says anomaly. Okay. 